Hello. Today, we will share a demo of TopRate Enterprise Data Governance, or TopRate Edge. TopRate Edge makes it possible for you to manage and govern a complete range of information assets. Different firms may have different priorities and starting points, but with Edge, you can start incrementally, for instance, with business glossaries or reference data, and extend your governance scope to other assets when you're ready to do so. Beyond just supporting specific data assets, such as catalogs of where data exists, there's a need to connect the business, technical, and operational metadata. And what's important is that TopRate Edge enables not only the representation, but also the connection of these data governance assets needed to answer questions such as, where does this data originate? TopRate Edge supports an incremental approach to governance with a comprehensive suite of modular packages. Each is available as an initial configuration of Edge, and the packages you see here can be added in any combination toward your targeted scope of data governance. Today's demo focuses on an important aspect of metadata management, the ability to trace data lineage. In regulatory compliance recording, it's critical to be able to prove to regulators where the data that you've reported came from. So in our demo, we're going to look at an example from finance, the Form Y9C. And we're using this Form Y9C as a compliance example, but the same kinds of lineage requirements would apply to other regulatory reporting forms, such as the Federal Reserve's Capital Analysis and Review, CCAR, and the Data Protection Regulation, GDPR, from the European Commission. Data lineage tracking for regulatory reporting is not easy. The Form Y9C that you see here itself is 65 pages long. The instructions run to 556 pages. It has a collection of schedules and a number of supporting schedules. And for this example, we'll be looking at the schedule HCR. HCR is important because it describes how well an institution is securitized. And if you're held accountable for this data, how can you know that you've gotten it right? We'll show how TopRate Edge can help you trace values that you report and be able to prove where they came from. So in our short demo, you're going to see how easy it is to track individual data values and their lineage on the FRY9C just by following the connections. We're going to look at this item, the S490, and as you can see in the screenshot at the bottom, top range edge models represent all of what's needed. What's less obvious is how these various data elements are connected. The form itself is composed of line items or amounts that derive from calculations depending on other inputs. In today's examples, we're going to trace this line item, the S490, or the total on balance sheet securitization exposures, and see where this data value comes from. Let's use Edge now to find out. So here we are at home screen of TopRate Edge. You can see on the left that Edge supports a variety of assets, models, and vocabularies for tracking, discovery, and reporting on the enterprise. And what's even more significant is that these models and assets span the spectrum with connection from high-level models to the most granular data elements. How does Edge support data lineage for Y9C? Well, it's all about following the connections. We'll trace the path and use this to visualize and understand, and it's exactly this understanding that's going to help ensure compliance. So we're going to select the bank lineage model to do this, and going into the bank lineage model, we're going to look at one aspect, and that aspect is the regulatory lineage models. Here you can see that there's one about securitization, and that one, if we open it up, you can see refers to the Schedule HCR. Well, this is good. We could click on these and follow them to understand the connections better between the models, the schedules, and the data items. And this helps us to begin to appreciate how things are connected, but can it be easier? And the answer is yes. TopRate Edge has a visualization engine 
that displays these relationships graphically. And we're going to take a look at that now and see here that this securitization model actually produces the HCR as an information asset. Well, where does it get the information to do that? We can see that it brings the information in from a pipeline. And what is a pipeline? Well, it's a direction information flow, and that flow can be fed by several pipeline steps, as you see here. And these steps are carriers of simple or transformed data. Well, something must feed the data into these pipeline steps. And if we were to look, we'll see that they're fed by a software program. And the software program will gather and ingest data from multiple inputs and transform these inputs into modified outputs. So here we can see the several inputs and the outputs that result among them are the S490 that we're looking for. We can see right away that the S490 is used on the reporting form Y9C and it gets there through the schedule HCR. That's great. What if we want to know where the data was coming from that was used to generate these outputs? We can see these inputs here that we mentioned and look, for example, at one of them. And we can see that this input, the exposure amount, uh, actually happens to be drawn from a column of a table called top rate bank securitization exposure. And you can see the data type as well. So what you've seen here is that schedule HCR is generated through an entire lineage of data that comes in from a schedule HCR pipeline that is fed by several pipeline steps, each one using a software program to transform a variety of input data into the outputs that are needed. And you can see the S490 that we were looking for. So what we've seen today is the top rate enterprise data governance is a new type of agile data governance solution. It uses a model-driven approach to capture and preserve the meaning of the data and the data elements. This modular approach helps organizations start with a simple focused area of governance, such as managing a business glossary, and still incrementally expand to a more comprehensive governance of critical business assets like data lineage. With Top Rate Edge, organizations are now finally able to connect their silos of data and metadata and to unlock the true meaning behind the business information. If you're interested in seeing how Top Rate Edge can help connect your data, please visit our website or contact us for a more targeted demo of Top Rate Edge. Thank you very much.